Good morning, Holy Trinity. Today is Wednesday, September 28th, and you're with your host, Jelaine. And Summer. Please rise for the playing of our national anthem. Good morning, Holy Trinity. Today we begin with a statement acknowledging the land on which we gather. We acknowledge that the land upon which we gather is the traditional territory of the Haudenosaunee and the Anishinaabe nations. We recognize that the Brand Haldeman Norfolk Catholic District School Board and its schools have many ties to Six Nations of the Grand River and Mississaugas of the Credit First Nations, situated on the traditional land of the Haudenosaunee and Anishinaabe, within the two of wampum and the one dish, one spoon treaty areas. As a Catholic learning community and as treaty people ourselves, we strive to build the kingdom of God, where all people are treated with respect and dignity as we move forward as allies towards truth and reconciliation. Good morning, everybody. Today is the third day of Truth and Reconciliation Week, uh, and today the main theme is solidarity, which is about uh, uh, commitment to the good of our neighbor. It's about saying yes to helping our neighbor and live in dignity and in peace. Um, so just on that, like we're all God's children and we are called to look out for one another's needs. This is what we call solidarity. Uh, so like, for example, have you ever um, had to stand up for someone because you knew it was the right thing to do? Were you ever uh, part of a group that tried to make someone else's life better? Uh, perhaps you've helped collect food for the food bank or St. Vincent de Paul or help raise money for the missions. How can you stand up for our brothers and sisters in Christ? Uh, Sorry, helping uh, in Christ help to change. How can you help change a situation when they don't have enough food, when they don't have water, proper medicine, or shelter, when they don't have a school, when they are treated poorly or made fun of? What small thing can I do today to support someone else? So we're going to read from the Book of Corinthians. If you want to join me, in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. For just as the body is one and has many members. And all the members of that body, uh, though many, are one body, so also is Christ. For in the one Spirit, all were baptized into one body, Jews or Greeks, slaves or free. We were all made to drink of the one Spirit. Indeed, the body does not consist of one member, but of many. If one member suffers, all suffer. If one member is honored, all rejoice together with it. So God, open our hearts to our neighbor in their needs. Strengthen us to walk lovingly along the path of solidarity as followers of Jesus, your Son. We ask this through the same Jesus, the Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. If you have not yet signed your name on the grade level banner for FAIR, Please come to the lower cap at lunch today to sign it. This is your last chance. Attention cross-country runners. Practices will continue Monday to Thursday after school this week. Meet outside of the phys ed office at 310. Please try to attend at least two practices and complete one run at home over the weekend. 
If you have not yet brought in your forms or cannot make two practices due to other sport commitments, please see Ms. DeConnick O'Neill in guidance. All runners are welcome. Anyone interested in running for the road race, which is 1.6 kilometers at fair, please see Ms. DeConnick O'Neill in guidance. Attention runners, anyone interested in joining the Holy Trinity team for the CIBC run for the cure this Sunday, please see Mr. Vanderweel in room 251. Everyone is welcome. Come out and run or walk for a great cause. Thank you to all students who submitted home craft entry forms last week. Please note your complete home craft items are due at the school in your homeroom on Monday, October 3rd. Classes will then be called down to the CAF by grade where fa fair tags will be attached. All items will then be dropped off to the fair on your behalf. The Social Justice Club will be having their first meeting of the year today over lunch in the chapel. All are welcome to come to check it out. Please bring your lunch. Do you enjoy board games or card games? If so, the HT Daily Games Club has started. You can come enjoy the fun over lunch in room number 149 each day of the week. The Titans girls basketball team opened up the regular season last night at home against Delhi. The junior girls fought a hard game against a very good Delhi team, but unfortunately fell short with a score of 31 to 22. Great plays were made by Sweet Thornell, Selena Gray, Sophie Sim, and Rachel Rogers. The senior girls continued their aggressive Vienpo after the SJC tournament and beat the Raiders by a score of 49 to 14. All girls contributed to the win, with Joanna Smith having a season high 30 points and Abby Benoway adding an eight. Great game girls to practice today after school. The French Club will be meeting at the beginning of lunch on Thursday, September 29th in room 146. Please bring your lunch. New members are always welcome. Today at the CAF, their lunch specials are chicken noodle soup, chicken finger combo, Mexican fries, and any burger combo, or any burger make a combo. That's all from us Titans. Now over to Ms. Charnish Curry. Morning Titans. Um, I forget what I was actually here to talk to you about because all I want to know is what Yenpo is or if that was a typo. Um, but for real, I do remember why I was here, and that's as the weather is getting colder, um, we are slipping back into old habits, which is the sweatpants and illegal sweaters at lunch. So a reminder, we've been great so far this year, and we're really proud of the fact that you have recognized in school in uniform, and we need to keep that up through colder weather. So if you need help from us in terms of accessing a uniform sweater or pants in the meantime while you wait for a sweater to come in, uh, please make sure to come talk to Mr. Nicholson or myself and we'll see how we can help you out with that. Thanks so much, Titans. Have a great day.